What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Retro Hunting Showdown. If you watched the last one, I crushed Dave pretty bad. I am still the champion. I have added the bill. I don't know uh, how they ever got along without me button to the belt. Of course, taking the belt with us while we're game hunting. Gonna bring me some good luck. I mean, apparently it's, it's worked so far for sure. And uh, But I need you, Thomas, in the car. Oh, yeah, like so, to, so like, oh, yes, okay, okay, yeah. Oh my god, this is torpedoes. Does it work? No. There's a sail behind us. You can see over my shoulder. All right, back there. We got a Barbie, uh, Horse Adventures. We got a Stitch. We got a Seal Guitar Hero Smash Hits. And a Barbie and the Twelve Dancing Princesses. That's a classic. A dollar? A dollar? <laughs> I'm going to take the belt up to at least one sale today and see if it can bring me some good luck. So here, Thomas, just, it, just it, film me. I'm it, going to see if this helps. It's not. It will. It will. It's not. Nothing? No, no video games? No, no. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. You guys have a good day. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. Maybe next time? All right. Yeah. No. It was. It did not bring me any luck. You were right, Thomas. I was. Sorry. I want to mention to you guys, please stick around during the showdown portion of the video because that's when we do the game giveaway and you have to watch that part to find out exactly how to enter. So keep watching, watch the showdown part. Also, subscribe, Thomas, your channel. Is Bonfire Games. Yep, Bonfire Games. Eddie, of course, helping doing the editing, a lot of filming elsewhere. Uh, uh, Retro Repair, YT, subscribe to them. But stick around for the rest of the video. I'm going to keep driving so we can go to more garage sales. What's up? Got Tommy here. We're going to be hunting for some video games this morning. Hey. Uh, bright and early. Thank you for being on time, Thomas. I appreciate that. This time, yeah. <laughs> Good looking out. <laughs> uh, we got energy drinks a-flowing. We're going to hit up some uh, some yard sales today. I am, uh, frankly, pretty disappointed in myself. I seem to not be able to beat Scott. But we're going to change up the plan a little bit today. So... We're going to hit our normal yard sales this morning for probably about an hour or so. But after that, we're going to hit Pawn Shop's heart. And so, if I get it before Scott does on a Saturday, I just assume that anything good in a Pawn Shop he's not going to have access to. So, that's the plan for today. Let's see what happens. Uh, Rambo, stuff like that. Do a kickflip! <laughs> I I think already with just this pickup, it's infinitely better than the last time we did this episode. So, uh, Tom and I just pulled up to a yard sale, uh, and we watched a lady carry out an Xbox 360 console E, and naturally I asked the question to see if she would recognize the fact that she had some right there in her hands. Do you have any video games for sale? And she said, uh, not for sale, but this is for free if you want it. So, for, <laughs> <laughs> for literally zero dollars, just picked up a console E Xbox 360 with a connect sensor the question is any hard drive any hard drive tom you want to take a, you want to take uh, a guess i'm gonna guess uh 250 250 i'm gonna guess 500 no way uh, wow. yeah Good guess all right so and then hey. and then uh they had they had this baby build louisville slugger for a quarter and i had to get it <laughs> yes that is called uh it's for home defense <laughs> <laughs> for rabbits. Yeah, yeah, rabbits yeah, there. yeah. 30 to 50 feral hogs. 30 to 50 is not that bad. <laughs> not 100%. That's not going to work. And now, Random Rants with Thomas and Dave. I, I can't tell you what makes a diner a diner, but but you know. Is a Denny's a diner? <sighs> no, right? I don't think so. No. I hop? Denny's is too. An IHOP? No, I don't think so. I think a diner has to be in a building that is over 40 years old. <laughs> Diners are a lot like pornography and that when you when you see it you know it like a health safety inspector comes to your diner and it's too clean then they revoke your diner license <laughs> I agree. a pancake is just a lazy waffle correct yes um so i don't actually really like the beetles that much i don't like the beetles either i hate that everybody loves beetles it's like white bread of music correct right? yes it's, yeah it's, and it's like it's like it's important like someone had to invent bread right it's in the same vein as elvis Dude, that's how I want to go. Uh, dying on the toilet. Eating a fried peanut butter and banana yeah. sandwich and yeah. dying on the toilet. It is, is go. It's fit. Rolling. Three, two, and. Yep. 
in the uh, first episode of Retro Hunting Showdown, I talked to you guys about using binoculars to like look at signs. You got a sign over there, you know, checking it out. But I really actually pulled this out because I want to talk about birding. Oh my god! It is no, migratory season right no, now, guys. No, no, yes, no, Thomas. No, no, no. Scarlet no tanagers, birds. No summer tanagers, no, no, no. rose-breasted grosbeaks. He he didn't tell me we we're talking about birds. He's like, I'm gonna film a clip. He didn't right tell now, me, guys. Birds coming up from South oh. America. Oh, get out and go do some birding. It is amazing. Hey, look, that's, that's which, which one is that? That's a common grackle over there. You. Yeah, you want to have a look? Here, hold on. All right, ready to go. There he is. Perfect. Cute little guy. Birds. This is so far what I'm interested in. There's a very big mix. Of stuff, some DS oh, yeah. games, there's a 3DS system, yeah, 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 yeah. a lot of randomness in this box. <laughs> Sweet box of random amiibos and little Funkos, a lot of Shulk in there, King Day Day Day, the Day Day Day, yeah, Charizard, some nice ones. Alright, so $60, 3DS stuff, Game Boy stuff. $30 there, so it's 90 bucks. All right, I got a big old stack of stuff. I'll head back to the car. I don't want you to help me carry it. I'm going <laughs> to drop it and fall down. <laughs> Thank you. That was quite the adventure. Um, we spent over an hour at that sale. Um, I did leave, obviously, with a bunch of stuff. I did not take all of the rock band guitars and like the drum set, but uh, we have a great story that we will tell you. Yeah. During, yeah. during the showdown part of what, why that took so long and what happened. That was wonderful. That lady was an enigma. Thomas almost bought a whole uh, box of broken phones. Just to spite someone. Just to get, just you know, to spite someone. get the ball yeah. rolling there. Anyways, uh, $180 for everything I got. And of course, we'll go through it and show you all the pieces when we do the showdown. But now let's finally go to more than... To the second sale. Two garage yeah. sales that we've been to. Well... This is the number one deterrent for yard sales. It's rain. Well, first is fire. Fire's pretty bad. Yeah. Uh, zombies, also bad if they somehow, the horde seems to show up at a yard sale. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, frankly, some of the yard sales I've been to, I'm pretty sure zombies were uh, running them. But, uh, yeah, we're going to have to flex to something different here. I'm pretty sure it's pawn shop time at this point. Yeah, no bueno for yard sales. Rain, bad. Hey, look, a fish crow. All right, first pawn shop pickup of the day. 360 games. It's always 360. 360, we, that's always it. Anyways, I'm not mad about it. Kind of mad about it. <laughs> but not really. Uh, picked up three 360 games, Alone in the Dark, Damnation, which I've never seen before. Be quiet, car. Okay. Thank you. Never. And uh, Forza Motorsport 4. And then behind the counter here. And some 3DS and DS games. So New Super Mario Bros. 2, Mario Kart 7, New Super Mario Bros. Obviously, everybody knows right now with the eShop closing down, 3DS stuff is starting to slowly climb. But 23 bucks for everything. That's Can't not beat bad. that. So a free Xbox 360 and some games. So on to the next pawn shop, see what we find. What up? You're on camera. Hi. Hi. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm on camera. Okay. Well, good. I'm on camera because I, 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 I need to call and let you know that um, all the, the Friday sales actually were canceled today. I don't know if you heard. So you can probably just go home. You don't even need to worry about hunting. Oh, we found uh, rain, but we also found <laughs> other, rain? Out, other rain. outlets to be able to uh, procure uh, particular items. So, Okay, all right. Well, good to hear that the rain hasn't uh, stopped your hunt, at least. As Millie Vanilli once said, some people like to blame it on the rain. I don't make excuses. I go for gold. Is the rain was the rain purple at least? That's well, a, it was blurple. That's a different a person. Of, yeah, that's them. It was a, <laughs> that's that's a different print. person. That's Prince, okay? Millie Vanilli were twins. Uh, you know, you so involved in music culture, I'm embarrassed that you don't know the difference between Prince and. Oh, Millie I Vanilli. was. I wasn't saying. I wasn't saying that Millie Vanilli made purple rain. I was just saying maybe it was better than Millie Vanilli. <laughs> All right, well, good. Keep going. Good luck. And uh, you know, I'm still gonna win, so it doesn't matter. Bye. Uh, that's factually correct. Check out this awesome cyber gaming starter pack. I mean, it's like you can have your own little convention. Look how excited oh, yeah. that kid is. Look at is. that kid. Look at that. Is that 
come with it? But, oh, like a, you get a sleeve, a gamer I'm head. Sorry, a g- I thought it was a tie. I thought a he had a tie. Gamer sleeve was it for like if you cramp up? Or yeah, something? he gets a little sweaty. Yeah, just like LeBron. Leapster, OG, first kids Game Boy, baby yeah. baby Game Boy, Leapfrog. No. So you're just leaving three yard sales right now. Sales over yeah. here. I got some Switch games. I got an Atari uh, flashback and a DS Lite that has some issues, but. Uh, it was five bucks, and I will tell you the price of these in the showdown so you stick around and you keep watching and you don't end right now. Yeah, because he forgot it. Yeah, I forgot the price. So, David, uh, you you had tried calling me while we were at an insane yard sale. Now, I'm not saying insane in the sense of pickups necessarily, but... Uh, insane in, in the sense of the people there. Yes, there was a, you have a great story to hear during the showdown, but um, what are you, why, why were you calling? What are you doing? I am hitting up a few pawn shops. I just want to make sure that you hadn't swung by yet before I go to them. You're not allowed to game hunt on Saturdays. Don't you know the rules? Yeah. I don't go yard selling, sailing, oh my. sailing, sailing, sailing on a Saturday. Okay. I go to pawn shops on a Saturday. So. Well, at least you're in. At least you were nice enough to call and see that you weren't going to go to pawn shops that maybe I was going to. So, uh, just don't go to any pawn shops in the state of Florida right now. That's the ones we're looking at. Yeah. I can neither confirm or deny that I have done the latter. So, say bye. Bye. And now more random rants with Thomas and Dave. What if a bloater from Last of Us 2 ate a whole entire canister of Beano or gas eggs? The idea is that they don't have working digestion systems. In their stomach would just be a pile of pills. Pills. Because okay. they're not digesting it. It's the same reason you can't like trank dart a zombie. That makes perfect sense. But how does a bloater happen? Is that just an overweight person? Is bloat shaming a real thing? Bloat shaming? I don't think so. They take a lot of bullets, man. They do, and they're gaseous. What is going on over here, man? And why are For all clickers zombies? women? I don't think I've ever seen a male clicker in the last really? episode. Really? How are you? Why are you? Why is that? What are you looking I'm worried about killing them, man. I do enjoy that in The Last of Us, the ingredients from Molotov cocktail are the exact same ones for a health kit. I, I do like that. <laughs> take You take a bat, you take a bat like yeah. this, right? Yes, and then you just duct tape scissors to it. Yes, and then you're like, correct. this is clearly much better. Games, games, games at another Cash America. Last stop of the day, yielded some pretty cool stuff. Bruce Lee on Xbox, which was, how much was that, Thomas? Um, a quarter? Free. Free. Free 99. Free 99. NES Classic Edition, CIB, great shape too in there, 50 bucks. And who can't love Chevy Chase's Christmas Vacation, National Weapons yeah. And that was free too, as well. So The Griswolds. The Griswolds. Good tidings, I... Yes, so. (laughs) Thomas has a new online store for Bonfire Games. If you can't make it to Tampa, Florida to check out the shop in person, then head on over to the website, see what's in stock, and make a purchase at bonfiregamestore.com. It's time for the showdown! (laughs) Brothers! Oh, my God. Apparently that was my inner Macho Man coming out. Uh, are you guys ready? Ready. Okay. Yeah, I'm now, gonna top that. I don't. I can try. No. Uh, after last showing that we yep. had last episode for for Dave, I really hope Dave that you have found more things this time. Uh, I certainly have. Yes, I've definitely know, found more things. Not to remind you or anything, but I am the two-time is that champion. Oh wait, yes, and I did have to add. If you watched the video game sellers episode where I did lose, Dave did win. Yes, uh, that's correct. He sold and traded more items away during the video game sellers episode. I had to add a pile of crap because it's it was just, crap it's that I disgusting. lost. Disgusting. Yes. Anyways, I it's, loved it's not, it before that. It's not real. Yeah. So, Where did you find that from? It was um, real. Man. I don't honestly know. I think honestly, I think it was like a weird Christmas present that someone gave, like in a, in the stocking. <laughs> he just has poop in his house. Anyways, you know? there's there's the the current conglomeration of belt items. And uh, we have Mr. Tickle and Snagglefruits here. Feel free, uh, Dave or Tom, whoever wants to tickle or bang on Snagglefruits. But uh, obviously, our, our yellow flag. Don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> in case, in case uh, you know, you need to call a flag. In case you want to beat on one of us for you know finding something. I'll just hit you. Yeah, just hit me. Yeah. 
that's not nice. Um, you, yes. you need to present an item to this belt now. I do have something for okay. the belt. I was going to say Stop. whip it out again, but we're not doing that joke. <laughs> Two episodes in a row, so I did you not just, say you that. just did. No, so, no. being obviously 90s kids, there's one thing that we always loved as it relates to any kind of toy or anything like that. And that candy. is... Candy! Well, candy was delicious too, but glow-in-the-dark items. Ooh. This is a Michelangelo pencil topper Let me see. That's that awesome. glows in the dark. That's very cool. I hope the, the uh, glue I use doesn't literally just melt him. That would be funny. Yeah, because awesome. it's some strong-ass glue. Dude, so really like it. Yeah. There's literal poop on that belt, so yeah. it's not going to get worse. There we go. Anyway, so I'll just uh, hang out right there. Who was it? Michael? Michelangelo? Michelangelo. Yeah. Cool. I'll hang there. All right. Michelangelo. We got our coin. What's our coin this time, Thomas? Puzzle challenge, crosswords, and more and for the more. PlayStation 2. No, don't waste system. that. That's good. Yeah. Um, yeah, you, the guy that took freaking cover art for Genesis games. And that, honestly. All like, right, I get it. That was the biggest shot. Hurt, that hurt me physically. <laughs> that, was a, right. that was a rough one. Anyways, go ahead and flip. Uh, you call it, because I think I called okay. it last time, so you call it. I'm going to go heads. Oh, oh, oh. Try it again. Oh, okay. Tails never I, I get to choose. Um, I I am gonna give it to him to start though this okay. time. So I want I want to see where we're what we're working with. It was a short dance party. So <laughs> it's almost summer here. It's May, right? It's Ooh. ninety degrees out. Yes, correct. And inside. <laughs> uh, so the old adage of Christmas in July, even though it's not July, it's only May. But I added. Oh. National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation on VH Evan. I'm pretty sure it was 25 <laughs> cents, but that, uh, I've got a very kind of small, really curated VHS collection, and obviously this being a Christmas classic, that's going to go in it. So Chevy Chase, National nice. Lampoon's yeah. Christmas Vacation. I heard he's a real nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> he. What was the show? Uh, community? Community, yeah. yeah. Apparently he wasn't too nice on yeah. Community. Too. His character was a jerk, it turns out. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Yeah. We have some... Uh, um, very big VHS collector friends. Like I have my friend Sprinkles, who used to be a part of video game sellers. Yep. We have a friend named Matt, who has a huge collection. Yep. So hopefully we'll see some more VHS. Yes, yeah, for sure. You know, out here. Yeah. Um, all right, me first item. Me first item. Me <laughs> is uh, there. <laughs> me first item is. Yeah. There Talk were. A I'm a pirate now. There were three sales all in the same little section. Yeah, that was uh, two on one side of the street, one on the other. As I'm on one side, I see Thomas like kind of walking into a garage and kind of like actually talking to someone, and he's like, "How do you say actually talking to not someone?" Not just. I've never. He doesn't yet speak. He just usually sits in, you know, yeah. in the yeah. car yeah. and like points. No. Yeah. I mean, like you could tell you were having a conversation yeah. about an item. You were like, you know, hey, what about yeah, that? Well, you know. Yeah. So I walk over. Oh yeah, and it did have. Honestly, the charger is almost more of a unique thing to fight at the right. Wow! Yeah. Charger, yeah. Yeah. She's like, I think I have the charger somewhere. I was like, you don't, but okay. This this was five bucks. Okay. There is an issue with the top screen. It actually works and plays games, but the top screen has like a line on it. So Eddie, maybe a macro. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Or you could turn it into a Game Boy macro. That's a cool thing Imagine people are doing with the now. True, yeah. true. It could be my, either way for five bucks. It's a it's a unique colored shell. What's that? Uh, what's that front? That color. Is that one of the dogs games? It might have been one of the ten dogs. dogs. That was a regular cool. one. Light yeah, sky be. blue, turquoise, emerald purple. Like the only show I can watch that I get work from. Exactly. Yeah. 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 As always, you know, go support Eddie. Uh, yeah, but you'll give channel. him something. Yeah, I'll give you this poop. <laughs> you can have the poop. There's many more to come. <laughs> All right, uh, um, your turn. Up. Cool. Uh, so we kind of uh, we did a little bit different. We 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 had rain that day. I remember yes. specifically. And uh, there wasn't a ton of yard sales, so we kind of flexed over to pawn shops and found some decent finds. But, you know, what's a, what's a retro hunting showdown without some Xbox 360 games? But uh, there were a bunch of Three episodes piece. in a row. It's going to be 20 billion episodes in a row. Yeah, that's true. Uh, Alone in the Dark, these were a buck piece. Terrible game. Is it really? Oh, God. Yeah, I heard. Looked interesting. Um, Damnation, which I've never seen before. So weird. I haven't game. played it myself. And then uh, Wars of Four. So for three bucks, for three games. Mm -hmm. Is it the... That one has the cars? Essentials it's the edition. essentials, though. It's not yeah, the full yeah. one. has cars, though. Beep, beep. Broom, broom. beep but it's for a buck a piece thing. nowadays with video games, if you find it for a buck a piece, just pick it up. Yeah, okay. unless it's mad. That's true. Mr. 360. <laughs> That's your new wow. All right. Um, it's from, like an area code. I will go with this. This was actually the last find of the day in my neighborhood, right by my house. These were a dollar each. Dollar. Similar to that uh, find, we have Barbie Horse Adventure. Hey! All right. It's like 
twenty dollars. Eh, I think you're fifteen dollars. We have a, a worse Barbie game, Barbie in the Twelve Dancing Princesses. I mean, you know, I'm trying to get a little bit of a different mixture of here, not just the same stuff all the time. Yeah. Uh, Stitch on Under, PS2. Is that experiment? Yeah, experiment six two six. Yeah. Yeah. And then you don't have to play the first six hundred twenty. <laughs> <laughs> And then finally, a sealed copy of Guitar Hero. Oh, that's pretty cool. Smash yeah. hits. For a buck? For a buck on the yeah. PS2. A sealed oh, anything God. on the PS2 for a dollar is not bad. That's awesome. Your turn. All right. Sorry. So. You dropped you dropped drop your Sony. Sony pop. We stopped at another pawn shop. I throw a flag on your Sony. I don't pop. understand what's happening. Uh, and picked up some loose 3DS games. Okay. Uh, these were five bucks a piece. And we got New Super Mario Bros. 2. Ooh. Mario Kart <laughs> 7. Yeah. And full honesty, this was loose. Uh, I had an extra. It's okay. I'm waiting. I'm uh, waiting. I'm, I'm waiting. Uh, listen. You better. My you point. did it to me. Anyways, my point Do is. It. There we go. Okay. okay. My point is, is that this case I've probably been sitting on for, I don't know, two to three months. So anytime I'm you sitting on it. <laughs> so I, I've been holding on to this case for probably about two or three months, but. I mean, I would tell most people, I, I don't throw away any manuals or case art unless the game's not absolutely worth anything. That but, is a good thing to think about. But it gives you an opportunity once you find it, because eventually you're going to find, especially something that's common as this game, you know, a loose cartridge for it. You can pair it together and get more value out of it. So I try never to get rid of these things. I Plus have, you can use the cases too. I have so. two bins at home of nothing but empty DS, Wii, Wii U cases. I'm assuming you have probably a, a ton. bin. Yeah. Whole ton. Yeah. All right. We have a lot here. But they're not in the cases. Where, where are we? What's this? This is uh, Tampa. Bonfire Games. Bonfire Games, right. Yeah. I tried to throw them that one. Right. Yeah. Anyway, so video game store in Tampa, Florida, bonfiregames.com. No. <laughs> it's not even the website. <laughs> I uh, want plus. not even the real website. I want every time <laughs> Thomas tries to give a shout out for <gasps> him, I want it to stay in from now on. So that way it's like the weirdest links or information. And then you can make a compilation at the end yeah, of the year. Yeah, yeah. It's like a treasure. My website. This is firebond. A, uh, shit. Fire this, is, <laughs> this is Dark Souls copyright infringement. Go to www.bonfire.eu.com. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, re reeling it back in here. Uh, back to the three sales that were in that same yep. you know little neighborhood. Uh, I did pick up a five dollar. I probably wouldn't have normally paid five bucks for this. It's the Atari Flashback Classics Volume One on Xbox One. Um, I wouldn't have usually paid five bucks, but the lady was so nice and like went into the house and like ten minutes dug yeah, around yeah. for some he games. Likes talking. Yeah, so I was like, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll pick it up for five bucks. Is that a reprint it says cover? Twenty dollars. Just kind of look retro like that. That's just how it looks. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. So. All right, back to you. Cool. Back to you, Dave. Back to me. Uh, let's do this. Yeah, we pick these up at the same time. So I picked up two more games for. Uh, Handheld systems. I love DS and 3DS. Stuff. I know. But oh, wait, know. I should be saying no. I hate DS and 3DS stuff. <laughs> yeah, those shouldn't are the worst. win. So the first one is Get Wrecked Ralph. I mean, Wreck It Ralph. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Ralph. Ouch. It's a 3DS game. Eshop's closing down. You know, it's not a really expensive one, but oh damn! Whoa. Pokemon Platinum. Is it, well. is it legit? Is it real? Yeah. Uh, well, you've That's, got a great just, video on your channel. That I do have a video here. on my channel that shows you how to look to see if at least the outer part... Did you just choke on a, on a game? I hate the Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> it is, it is you, real. It has yeah, the you, right... You taste it and then there's a taste slick. That's a Switch game. Yeah. It has the right little markings on the top. You're looking for little indent like rectangles. If you've never seen that video, go look at up on my channel. It's how to spot like fake DS. It's super games, helpful. So. It's the only yeah. thing that I'd use at this point to try to determine if a game is real. It's a fake. dumb find and it's bad. Oh, I don't like okay. it. I think it's neat. Yeah. All right. Um, I can't tell you. The, <laughs> yeah, you're not allowed to, to say to me. Um, this is the last of the... Oh, so this is, I guess, adding to the fact that those three sales, every single sale had games. That's was, awesome. That rarely happens. happens. Yeah, yeah, 100 percent uh, yeah. luck there. Um, this is the best two games that were at those three sales, and a copy. It is a PAL copy of Link's Awakening. Okay. On the Switch, but it'll work oh, obviously in the system. That was 15, and then a sealed copy of Breath of the Wild. The wow. new Zelda game. Yeah, the brand new. The brand new. Um, March set 2017. 20 bucks. I think the the lady originally wanted like. 
40? I think it was more like 40 bucks. Really? It's around like 30 and then like 15 or something yeah. like that. So 35 bucks for the two of these was pretty dang good. Cons deal. Considering it was gonna end up being like 40 or more dollars for them, so. All right, back to you, sir. Back to me. You can uh, keep using Mr. Tickle to dab sweat off of our face. We have to turn one of the AC units off because it would be way too loud for yeah. the microphone. We care about sound quality. Yeah, not sweaty, so we apologize me, 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 me. For, for wet. Uh, all right, so another pawn shop find. A complete in box NES classic. Ooh. Mm -hmm. uh, that was only 50 bucks. And then they threw in this game. Well, Sean, who works here, is a big Xbox collector, so perhaps yeah. maybe he needs it for his collection. But Sean, do you need Sean, Bruce do you Lee? Need that? Bruce Lee, Quest of the Dragon? I have to check my collection. You gotta check it? <laughs> well, 200 I... games is kind of hard to remember. Oh! oh! I'm Sean, I have 200 games. <laughs> Sell flex, but uh, they threw that in for free, so pretty it's cool. It's got Bruce Lee in it, so 50 does Taekwondo. It was a good flex. 50, and I, to be I honest with you, it's got all the packaging still. I, I don't know if it's ever been used. It wasn't really that dirty, okay. so to speak, to begin with, but everything's in there. And you are bringing it a little bit better than last time, I will say. It's a really high bar. Yeah. So now, actually, I go on to my final pickup. I've got one left too, so this is gonna be perfect. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. So. This pickup, though, this pickup is one of those that. Shut up. <laughs> Me? It's just my final pickup. My I mean, final pickup. Yes. It's gonna last a while. <laughs> okay, that's fine. This was the third sale we went to. You only went to three sales that entire day. You're saying? No, no, no. Oh, In okay. the morning. This yeah. was the third find. The third sale we went to. The third find. Uh, actually, oh, first yeah. find. Sorry. The first two sales we went to didn't have anything. They were actually sales we had already been to in the past. So this was literally actually like the first new sale. We get out of the car. I see some PS4s uh, up on a table. Games. Oh, no, they were consoles. They were the yeah, consoles. Two, two PS4 two systems. PS4 consoles. And I look in the garage, and I see there's like a drum set for Rock Band. And I was like, all right, well. And then I notice that I know the guy. Like, he is someone who's working at GameStop, right. tons of customers, you know, and he noticed me of being a GameStop employee from the past, so he's like, hey man, how you doing? Blah, blah, we started talking, and then for the next two hours, we were at this sale. You were talking to him for two well, hours? Well, it's a long story. There was a lady that came up who was trying to buy phones, and she would not <clears throat> just either decide yes or no. Yeah? House phones or like what kind of phones? No, cell phones. Like a cell box phones. like that had iPhones. Yeah. Okay. She and ended up she ended up causing a lot of disturbance in this deal. Oh, that's I've the worst I've when been, you're trying to buy something. Yeah, I've sale. been to so many yard sales and I've never seen any. Start showing like you guys some ever. games. So we got God of War Collection PS3, cool. Dead Space, Great Game, uh, Ratchet and Clank Future. Actually, it's not this. It is the Crack in Time, not Tools of Destruction. So wrong game in the case. Uh, a Guitar Hero Live on the PS4, a sealed Rock Band for three sealed games, like Rod oh, Shells wow. would say, uh, Mortal Kombat 11, uh, Batman oh, yeah. Return to Arkham, okay. uh, <laughs> Dragon Ball Z, uh, Dragon Ball Xenoverse, sorry, Until Dawn, and a Ratchet and, and Clank uh, All for One. So this was sort of like the first set of stuff yep. that was coming out. Uh, then... Wait, what'd you pay for that first set there? So actually, they were kind of broken up. It, it's hard to say what I paid for that. I can tell you exactly what I paid for some of the other okay, stuff. Cool. Um, this honestly was probably like twenty bucks. Okay. I want to say it was like two dollars. It, it was a good deal. Yeah. So then he had a 3ds XL. Oh, sweet. A red one. It came in with this case, so I didn't like add this or anything. It came in this little pouch. So there's the system. Charger, all in the box. All that, the inserts for the box, too? All the yeah, in there? That's yeah. awesome. That, and all these games, Project X Zone. Ooh. Ooh. That's a pricey one. Pokemon Sun, Pokemon Omega Ruby, Super Smash Brothers on the 3DS, and Zelda Link Between Worlds. Oh. That was 60 bucks. Wow. But wait, wait, it included more wait, for the 60 wait. bucks. Wait, 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 60 bucks? With the console? Yeah. 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 That's a steal. Zelda yeah. Phantom Hourglass. Stole it from the guy. Okay. Sonic Classic Collection. What? And. Wait, you say Phantom Hourglass? Yeah, Phantom Hourglass. Whoa. Yeah. And a uh, Kingdom Hearts and a hair. Chains of Memory. Which obviously clearly you can play the 3DS. Yeah, right. Well, this was all included for the $60. Okay. SpongeBob <laughs> SquarePants. Uh, Battle for Bikini Bottom, Mario Kart Super Circuit, and a Yu-Gi-Oh! Dark Duel Story. So 60 bucks 
for that. That's a killer deal. I will reverse a little bit and say that this all started with those PS4, the games, and then there was a bunch of instruments. And then that's when we finally started negotiating. The first thing that happened was I was like, how about all these instruments? There were three guitars and the yeah. drum set, a microphone, and he wanted $200, which in theory, that's not a bad price for it's all those instruments. Horrible. But I have no idea if they all work. Uh, yeah, you know, sales are huge. Two hundred dollars is a little bit much at a garage sale. So we, I backed out and I was like, "How about this one guitar that, of course, oh, had the dongle yeah. with it?" Uh, and I said, "How about one guitar?" And he said, 20 bucks." So f I thought getting one guitar for twenty bucks was better than trying to negotiate two hundred dollars. You imagine if it was the Jaguar guitar for PS4 though, the Guitar Hero one. That one goes for crazy. Yes. Money. This is a pretty basic one, yeah. but the the dongle alone is worth this. More than the guitar. Oh, yeah. The same guitar. yeah. Um, and then I'll kind of go fast for some of this. This is also the same sale. So okay. obviously, uh, we have a Super Bomberman on the Switch, yep. Pokemon Sword mm -hmm. on the Switch. This is empty. <laughs> Sunshine. We just talked about why it's important yeah. to keep empty cases. Keep your cases yeah. for yeah. sure. Pick them. I mean, it was thrown in, it was free, essentially, a part yeah. of the deal. Some other random things, a little Ouija, little Switch, Joy-Con holder. Or pad, isn't it? Uh, oh, oh, empty cases, just empty. This one is not. That has what does it have in it? Oh. Uh, Pokemon. Let's go Pikachu. Oh, because if I had the ball too, uh, yeah. I have the little I ball that, controller. Yeah. Those are weird. There but you like, go. Charger for something. I think it was just extra charged cable. Sorry, I'm almost done. No, almost done. Uh, a Batman Crimson Mist. Oh, that's figure. pretty cool. This was two dollars. Um, apparently, yeah, apparently it's like a $70, $60. Is it really? Yeah, it's pretty up there. What well, year is it? I don't know, look at it while I pull more <laughs> stuff out real quick. I don't know, you look. We've got Copyright date. the Mortal Kombat X Collector's Edition. No game, but the statue is in here and all the paperwork and everything. Awesome. Yeah. All right, just a, just a couple amiibos here. Um, just help me like name them as I put them up, you guys. I mean, I don't know what yeah. Lady in the Purple this Dress. Is, this is Zelda. Princess Zelda. Toon it's Zelda from Zelda. That's what's in this Zelda. Pikachu. That's Digimon. Rob the Robot. Yep. Princess Peach. Yep. Yeah, each of Peach, Peach, Peach. <laughs> Olimar. Yeah. From Who's that? A good game. That's a dog. And, a and the dog. duck. And a duck. Duck hunt. Oh, yep. Yeah. We have. Mr. Game and Watch with all of his little oh. partners there. So they're the bacon one. We got a uh, Fire Emblem character. Come on. Mars? Oh. Yeah. Uh, you know, the one that looks different than the other one. Lucario? Lucario. What's that for? Yeah. Oh. Uh, 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 Link's Waltz Amiibo. It's Zelda. Come on, guys. Twilight. Zelda. That's not an Amiibo. Is that Twilight Princess? Yeah, Dr. Mario. That's a drug dealer. Pac Man. <laughs> Luigi. Donkey Kong. Mario Fireball. Yoshi. Thank you, Chief. Sonic on the Grand Tour. Charles Martin. Fucking Mega Man. Help me, help me, Thomas. When's the Skylanders coming? Toad. Yoshi. Link on the corner. Another Luigi. Another Princess. Hello, Kirby. Don't take a nap. Wake up, wake up. Oh, my God. Samus. I almost said Metroid. Samus. It's Metroid from Metroid. A boozer. Another boozer. What? We got a chic. Uh, you fit over there, girl. I'm about to chic my pants. <laughs> <laughs> Another Mario. I said just a couple, Dave. Hold Calm on. Down. He's almost done with his fire attack. Shulk. Shulk. Put him up there. I'm gonna, he's going to be sulking <laughs> with <laughs> <laughs> And a, a Mewtwo. He has a van full of uh, Skylanders now. That is all. That's all. Those little, there is also a random assortment of Batman little like Funko Ooh, toys what? and a couple keychains for like Zelda. What's and, that guy? And a, a, a Daryl from Walking Dead. Walking Dead. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So very so oh god, hundred dollars for the Daryl. So all of this, everything at his sale, ended up being one hundred eighty bucks. Wow. Yes. Yeah. Everything there, one hundred eighty bucks. That's like, crazy. The bin of amiibos <laughs> and toys is thirty dollars. So, nuts. You still have to go. Hey, oh, damn. That was that was a good score. Damn, okay. Wow. All right, well, this is going to be underwhelming, but uh, <laughs> uh, it hasn't happened probably in a long, long time. Uh, Thomas and I were at a sale, and uh, a couple ladies were setting up, and we asked, hey, do you have anything video game? I'm sorry, sorry that sound must be awful. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty bad. Uh, we said, do you have anything video game related? And uh, they said, is this a video game thing? And they said, we're bringing it out. <laughs> And they go, uh, I go, yeah, that's that's considered video games. I go, how much do you want for it? And they're like, ah, just take it. And actually, oh. for free, zero dollars. Okay. So, I remember this too. Sealed Mario. No. 
It's an Xbox console E, 500 gigabyte. Oh, okay. Rent the Kinect sensor for zero dollars overall. But so no controller, but no controller, console, Kinect sensor, power cable for it. Ended up testing it. Testing works perfect. Okay. And a 500 gig, 500 gig hard drive. Oh, no. Actually, because <laughs> he's gonna break it. You into okay? <laughs> he won't come out. It no longer works, guys. Sorry. Thomas broke the hard drive. I, I own a game store, okay? I know what I'm doing. 500 gigabytes. I don't know why I needed to show you that. <laughs> okay, so I feel like this is a good little time to pop in and uh, announce the game winner from the last episode. Yeah. As always, we are filming this on the night before the episode that goes up would have the winner in it, so we don't know who wins yet. So we're going to have to do the same thing we did last time and just overdub it. So, I love uh, doing that. Give us a drum roll. Use uh, Snaggle Fruits there so we get a good knock. Is that this one? It's not the... No. I don't, under, I don't know the character, That would be a soft, soft I didn't watch knock. his old video. A hard Except knock. Except the ones with me because I'm a narcissist. <laughs> All right, right. Drum roll, please. The winner of this random game giveaway is... 64 Carmangia. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you <laughs> so much for watching. I'm proud of you. And guess what? As always, there's another random game giveaway starting right now. All you have to do is be subscribed, thumbs up the video, leave a comment down below. The suggestion for the comment in this episode is, what is your favorite cartoon of all time? Oh, cool. So, I mean, it doesn't matter if it's new, old, whatever. Uh, quick, what's yours? Beast Wars. What's yours? Oh, man. Oh, uh, oh man. He loves Iowa. Oh, oh man. man. Yes, I'm Nickelodeon. No, no, no. That no, was very no. show. Oh. Rugrats. Oh, oh Rugrats? there you go. Okay. I'm gonna like say, he's, he's uh, right. I'll say South Park only because that's the only thing I can think of on top of my head from the last like 25 years. But Mom, what, what if, you got a problem time. with that, Eddie? Animania! Hey! hey. Yeah. That's a good call. I thought you were just gonna say anim anime, like all of it. Subscribe, <laughs> it's my leave a comment. Too, is the genre. Thumbs up, it's all you have to do to enter, and obviously you have about a month roughly until the next episode goes up and until you have to, you know, do all that stuff. So thank you. Order in the court. I'm really hurting. <laughs> I think. Snaggle fruits? Okay. I started the gavel hitting and have not decided who wins yet. Oh, God. Uh, okay. I mean, to do... <laughs> oh, my order. To, to do a, a little <laughs> debating, I mean, this... I'll actually be nice. Maybe that'll work. Um, you you got way better stuff than last time. Yes. That, that NES Classic is pretty damn good for 50 bucks in the box. Pokemon Platinum. How much was Platinum? I'm sorry, I forgot. Uh, I think I paid 70 for it, if I remember. Okay, so yeah. not not like five bucks or no, anything, yeah, yeah. but no, below no the value yeah. that you know it would go for on the interwebs. But then, uh, and then something else happened over here. Two hours at we one. We did, yes, yeah. At what cost is what I would say about all of this wonderful deal? Because that was the worst. That's a crazy deal. That was, but she, it, man, it dude, was an like, experience for yeah. sure. But I mean, I, I mean, I was rude to her. <laughs> Like, I don't do that. <laughs> well, don't let that affect your judgment. But it's no. up. It's up. Here, let me. Sorry, let me. There we go. <laughs> well, let me well, hand you the belt. Yeah, Careful okay. with it. It has poop on it. Poop. Yeah. Who's the winner, Thomas? Should I do that? Yeah, let's do it three times. There we go. <laughs> um, the winner for this one is Scott. Three times. Oh, sorry. Three times. I, hey, well deserved, here's, sir. So here's, well deserved. Here's well thing. deserved. Yeah. Not like a turkey. I will say one thing at least. A, is that what it's called? A turkey. Oh, if oh, I was yeah, born, if you were born, yeah, it's a turkey. Awards other than that. I gotta say this though. If it wasn't for that sale that we spent all that time at, every other sale venture either had sold the games already or they right. didn't have anything. It, was not great. it would have been rough because we did go to a couple pawn shops. They didn't have anything. Pawn shops were awful. You, were they really? Oh my oh, god, They were terrible. Yeah. You would have won literally if it wasn't for one sale. So for anyone that's like, okay, the Scott won three times, it's Friday and Saturday still is a very like, you don't know what you're going to get. Correct. So I yep. mean, it rained. He went out on a Friday and got all this stuff at pawn shops. I went to pawn shops on Saturday and it was terrible. So yeah. They had like an $80 NES game for but, but, $200. But I still won. What a haul of Amiibos, though. That's awesome. That's yeah, Honestly, yeah. that was what made me have to go with that. Because that's just an absurd amount of Amiibos. Thank you all for watching. Pass me the Sonic one. The Sonic one? Keep on watching. Hope you watched all the way to the end. Everyone, please say goodbye to the fans. Goodbye. That's you guys. See you guys. Bye. Thank you. Bye. That's you guys. Peace. Um, I'm a little dirty. Uh, well, yeah, that sounds bad. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a little dirty. I'm a little, I'm a little dirty. dirty. I am a little dirty, but correct.
too hot in here. It is pretty warm. Yeah. Oh, sorry. It's, it's on you. All right. What's up, everybody? Ow! It's hot. <laughs> um, I did that twice now. I burned myself. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the. God damn it! 